So, I'm pretty sure we all have heard it before. Either you're pretty for a dark-skinned girl, or you're white on the inside, black on the outside. We've heard it all, but come on now. What sparks you most than when you're looking at somebody, a black person, with beautiful long hair, and then some ignorant, ignorant person says, are you mixed? What do you mix with? You can't be fully black. Like, what is that supposed to mean? Especially, you know, when another black person asks a black person that. It's like, come on now. You're making yourself look bad. Just because you black does not mean you have slave hair. It doesn't mean that you're going to walk around here looking bald-headed or that your hair is going to be half done. No, that's a stereotype. You're black. Black people can grow long hair just like any other ethnic group. And I can't stand it. I was just like going through videos, watching videos of black people with their natural hair because I'm going natural. And people say, well, are you mixed? What do you mix with? You can't just be black. Why? Why? Why can't I be black and have a head full of long, beautiful hair? Hair. Why can't I be black and have long, curly curls? Why can't I? Why, I mean, why do I have to be mixed with something? It's kind of embarrassing. Just because I'm black, I have to have slave hair, or I have to be bald-headed, or I have to have short hair, like that much standing on the top of my head. No, I'm black. Black people have very long hair. If you Google it, Africans, you'll see Africans with very long hair. But, you know, you're going to have people with the slave mentality. You're going to have people to, you know, they, you don't, most... Most black people in general, they're not diverse. Most, not all of them, most. They're not diverse. So you can't expect most of them to know, you know, what they should know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you feel me, but I'm getting somewhere. I'm getting somewhere. I feel me. That's all that matters. It's, it's kind of embarrassing. I don't want to go natural and have my hair out in this long and curly and somebody comes up to that and asks me oh like are you mixed with like indian or something no that will cause me to cuss somebody out especially if you're black if you're black now if you're a different race then that's okay what do you know but come on now you're black don't question another person about their ethnic background because of the fact that they have long hair black people can grow long hair too it's a matter of you taking care of it most of them not all of them i'm gonna say half of them don't do that half of them you know they just act as if their hair isn't their temple it isn't their crown you know they don't care but you then have the other half of us who actually cares who actually sits down and takes the time to brush our hair grease it comb it take care of it and with all of that comes length you know you're gonna have pretty hair when you take care of it and that's what anybody any ethnic group anybody it doesn't matter who you are so just because i have long hair that flows down to my back it doesn't mean that i'm not black it doesn't mean that i'm mixed no sweetheart i am just as black as you are i just have long pretty hair because i choose to take care of it that's why now what about you what is your excuse for not having long pretty black hair like me can you not grow it out or do you not take care of it i mean come on now not everybody has genes to have long hair but those that do doesn't mean that they're mixed you have people in africa oh my god you don't understand you have africans who have gorgeous hair east africans that one east african model she's beautiful she is dark skin very beautiful dark skin tall gorgeous and has hair very very long very very long hair and then like that other african she's um i think she's south african who's bald just has slick bald hair it doesn't matter it does not matter you don't have to be mixed they're african 100 percent african they just came from two different parts of Africa, but they're still African. They're still black. So you don't have to be mixed with something just to have long hair. And if you're black and somebody asks you because you have long hair, are you mixed? Sweetheart, I'm not telling you to be rude. 
but put them in their place, Expo especially if they're just as black as you. You do not have to be bald-headed because you're black. No, not everybody can retain length, but those that can are blessed. I mean, come on now. The long hair is gorgeous, and so is short hair. But walking around here looking bald-headed, just because you don't take care of your hair, your ends look cut up and chewed off, and like your hair is in different layers because you choose not to take care of it, that's nobody's fault but sure, sweetheart. Ain't nobody fault you bald-headed. Just how it is. That's all I had to say.